Welcome to the Museum of Artifacts That Made America, and the story of a founding father's ingenious invention that changed the way we work. As one of the authors of the Declaration of Independence, Thomas Jefferson's words helped found a nation. But did you know that he was also a keen inventor? In the late 1700s, Jefferson purchased an English-style Windsor chair, sometimes referred to as a comb chair, because the spindles along the chair back lined up like the teeth of a comb. This wooden chair was named after the English town of Windsor, where the queen spends her weekends. But Jefferson found the Windsor chair too rigid and decided it would be more functional and efficient if it could spin in different directions. So he set about modifying the chair to be more ergonomic. To allow the chair to turn, Jefferson added a central iron spindle between two seats. This spindle allowed the chair to rotate on rollers, which he took from window sash pulleys. And there you have it. Jefferson had created what's believed to be the world's first swivel chair. He also customized it with a little writing desk. Jefferson was so pleased with his new and improved seat design that he adapted other chairs in the same way and used them throughout his tenure as the third president of the United States. Now tucked under millions of desks around the world, the modern swivel chair has made workplaces more functional and in some cases, more stylish. The most expensive, created by a high-end Italian auto designer, will reportedly set you back a cool $1.5 million. But it's the humble, homemade Jefferson original that is a prized artifact at the American Philosophical Society in Philadelphia. What other examples of American design have stood the test of time? 